What's up everybody? I am here at Alexander Springs. I've been here before in past videos, but I'm here this time. I'm gonna do some camping. If y'all have noticed and been following my videos lately, I just graduated from Full Sail again with my master's degree and uh, I just moved out of my apartment, which was, uh, was pretty easy because I didn't have that much stuff th there. So a lot of my stuff is in storage right now, but I still do have some stuff here. And just I just randomly decided, hey, I'm gonna camp out and instead of staying in a hotel room and I just have to go through my, my van here and try to make it as comfortable as possible and see what I can do with it. But yeah, it's gonna be camping overnight here in Alexander Springs. Time for lunch. So I can't move into my camping spot until two o'clock. So I got a little bit of time. We're gonna walk around. I'm gonna reintroduce y'all to the spring here. But yeah, I wanna get set up and uh, do my, my impromptu camping. So last time I was here, this area, you could walk through it, but it's blocked off now because they're trying to restore up the uh, greenery. Other than the uh, amazing water here at the springs, there's really not many hiking trails. The one boardwalk that they have is closed down still because it was closed last time when I came here. But I'm gonna hang out for a little bit and wait till I can go to the campsite, but I'm gonna go grab some firewood. I got some fire stuff to go with it and have a, a fun little bonfire. Not a bad little camping site. I paid 45 bucks for the night, which isn't bad. I would have been paying like close to 200 for a uh, hotel. My own little, little spot here, which is really nice. And then you got a little area here if you wanted to put up a tent. And uh, you got your little fire pit over here. And then picnic table, we're good. So seeing that we're in Florida, it's raining, which is perfect, so it cools it off out of here. Keeping my uh, firewood in the van for now, keep it dry. So hopefully it'll stop raining later so we can have a bonfire at night. But I mean, I won't complain if it just rains the rest of the, uh, the day into the night. It'd be a perfect way to go to sleep, but just leaving the back of my uh, van open, which is uh, perfect. Get that nice air in here and uh, just take taking her easy. It's been pretty nice so far. It's been overcast all day anyway, but y'all didn't see. I, uh, well, you didn't see, but on my way here, I ended up taking a service road, which was, I mean, it wasn't a, wasn't a mistake, but it was a little rough. Hey, but the, uh, the shagging wagon beasted through that service road. We're going through it pretty good. And luckily there was no wet roads yet or anything that I would have got stuck in, but got a little dusted, not too bad. But just talking to y'all right now, I'm, I'm excited about moving. It sucks to leave friends and people that I know here in Florida for a little while, but I'm gonna get out of here for a little while, probably go up to South Carolina, possibly 
and maybe even go to school there for five, six months. I'm gonna, I, I'm looking at trying to do some specific stuff. I wanna get more into cinematography so it can help improve my YouTube channel and doing movies. I wanted to be, have a little bit more uh, of a, a ability to uh, work and to be able to use cameras, that kind of stuff. I find it's uh, uh, interesting. And then once I've done that and saved up a little bit of money, paid off some bills, then I'll possibly come back to Florida. Won't be Orlando. It'll probably be outside Orlando somewhere, but that's that's my plans for now. That, for now. I'm going to be looking for work while I'm going to school. And then if a job comes up, I'll just dip out of school because I'll just be going for a certificate. I, it, it doesn't matter if I get that or not. But um, yeah, get to spend some time with family, which will be good too. Stop raining. It's a little bit darker now. I'm just gonna wait for it to get darker. And we're gonna put up the, uh, or try to set up the uh, fire pit. Get a little bit of that going. Check that out for a little bit. Looks like I'm the only one with a campfire going right now. So everybody else is kind of still putting up their tents, putting up their air mattresses. You've got a few RVs that are here that are uh, setting up chalks and, and doing their thing, but got a little bit of uh, firewood to burn. And then I'm gonna go to my van here in a little, little while. I'm gonna wait till this is completely done. And then, uh, eat a little bit of dinner and then watch something on my phone and then go to bed. But there's absolutely no better. I, I love the smell of a fireplace, burning wood, that kind of stuff. Fire pits are, um, it's kind of a, a soothing thing. And I should do this a lot more camping at these parks and, and doing these fire pit stuff. And it's good. It's good for your soul. Good for your, uh, my anxiety. All right, y'all, my fire is out and I'm laying in my, oh, I'm in my van right now and I'm getting ready to go to bed. So I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully I'll have a good sleep. Good morning, everybody. I, I slept about as good as you could sleep uh, laying on the, the floor of this van. But other than that, it wasn't too bad. Uh, I had a really good time. It was well needed. And it's time for me to go take a shower here at the uh, park somewhere. And uh, I'm glad y'all were with me this time. And uh, hopefully y'all subscribe to the channel, uh, share with your friends, like the hell out of these videos. Uh, but until next time, love y'all. Peace.